Well, guys, old stump here. Got a right nice looking day out here. Somewhat warm. Supposed to be in the low 60s, but the sun will be going down soon. So, uh, it's almost time to eat. Might be having something weird to y'all. It's not going to be weird to me. But, uh, want to just invite you to, you know, come on in. If you happen to be around or other than that, enjoy the video. So, let's go ahead and eat. Come on in here. Oh, guys. Well, we're in the kitchen fixing to eat. <clears throat> uh, as y'all can see, uh, I do have a hamburger here and some fries. But we're going to have the famous, it would be really famous if some of y'all will try it, the famous Stumps Ravioli Burger. Got a hamburger, got some mozzarella cheese on the bottom, I'm gonna put a little bit on top. Right there. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna sprinkle some on my fries. This is how you make the mozzarella burger. I mean the uh, ravioli burger with mozzarella cheese. You want to take some ravioli. Lay up there, make sure it's good and hot. And this is uh, going to be everybody's favorite. Chef Boyardee ravioli. Oh yeah. You lay that on top. Get that hamburger and hopefully it'll stay. And this is what it looks like put together. <coughs> I haven't had this before, but it will be one of Stump's famous ravioli burger because i know some of y'all will join it making it would you like a bite no thank you don't pay attention to that phone i don't know if you want to get it in the case it's the doctor but... so let's take a bite of this let's take a bite of this ravioli with mozzarella cheese hamburger About pretty good because it didn't have no meat in it, so see if it'll stay it's kind of messy. That bite was pretty good. It is a little bit messy. Got my set uh, sesame seed bun, which I do like. Mm. Key's getting this ravioli to stay in there. Eat some, uh, a little bit of sauce on there, but. Pretty good hamburger. The mozzarella cheese is, is melting. Mm. They're pretty good and just ain't staying together. Hamburger's actually sliding all over the place. Probably the way I got it put together. Because I did put some cheese on the bottom. 
in a bun. A lot of sides may say bun, but it's not holding up too well. You're probably too soggy, I tell you. Hmm? Probably too soggy. That's good, though. It tastes good. Of course, this came from the mines of snot, so. Mm. Had a pretty good day today. Nice and warm. It's ain't bad. Probably needed. Probably need a little thicker bun. I mean, a little thinner patty. But it is a good patty. And how many of y'all are brave enough to try this? Might want to get a little a bun that's a little bit more sturdy. <clears throat> that ravioli is sitting right up on top there. That is good. I like that. That's not Mrs. Stump Sweet Tea. Really good burger. The ravioli sits well with it. You just need a you just need a stronger bun. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this and finish this hamburger. <clears throat> Don't want the video to be too long. I would say give it a shot. It's Stump's famous ravioli burger. Anything to add? You don't want back? I'm positive. Mine tastes just fine without it. Okay. I'm going to have some ravioli left over. I'm going to eat. So we'll end this. Uh, hope some of y'all will try it. And if you don't, you don't know what you're missing. And uh, appreciate all y'all watching. And we will see you on the next video, crazy or not.